hold on for just a minute. No problem. Okay, hang on a second. Yeah. As soon as possible. Right. Please continue to hold. Are right, so you still there? Yes, I am. Okay. Uh, let's get came to our office. Show our Facebook. So you're so October twentieth is when it apparently be, was started. Uh, I'm one what first start, sir. You're saying ten. Ten twelve two thousand ten is the date. That's in my case book. Okay. Oh, so October twelfth. Okay. Um, because I had a conversation with the chief in October two months before that, and he said an investigation was being conducted, and then I was later contacted by your colleague about it in reference to it. Okay. I, I can't answer that. I think that shows up in my case. Hmm. Okay. Is uh is Mike Cable around by chance? Could I speak with him? Uh, Mike Cable is uh, back in the uniform bureau. He's no longer with this uh, unit. Uh, he's back out of the Northampton headquarters, but he won't be able to help you. I mean, he'll, he'll refer you back here. So, are you the liaison on this issue for the time being? I would be your point of contact, yes, sir. And and so you're telling me I need to provide specific language about I, complaints I'm, I'm I have. I'm to provide a, a statement as to particularly what your complaints are. I will happily follow up. Um, yes, please. Okay, let me know when you're ready. Yep, I'm ready, go ahead. Okay, it's Lieutenant Michael Barrett, B-A-R-R-E-T-T. -E okay. You do a chair of the Northwestern District Attorney's Office. Okay. One Gleason, D-L-E-A-S-O-N, Plaza. Okay. That's in Northampton, Massachusetts. Okay. O one O six zero. 1060. Okay. Um. So, why don't you drop the statement, uh, specifically delineate what your complaints are, and we'll go from there. And please include an address where I can communicate with you. Okay. Phone communication. And another um, question I have about this uh, bef before we part ways on uh, July, uh, July 12th of this, uh, a month ago. I stopped by the Greenfield Police Department and wrote uh, criminal complaints against two individuals who uh, went inside my vehicle without a warrant and took my property and damaged my property. And I submitted these uh, walk-in criminal complaints uh, and was and I asked about the timeline, how long it may take uh, to receive any response. And I was told right away that um, an investigation had already been conducted and it was done by the state patrol so that they were not going to act on it internally so do you have any information okay. about that i don't know was that one of your initial complaints to lieutenant hable i again i was not asked to provide any complaint to lieutenant hable i was merely seeking the investigation uh, outcome okay, that well, you were already being conducted okay well i'll tell you your summary why don't you uh, elaborate on that I'm, I'm not familiar with that uh, that communication, or that communication wasn't brought forth to me back in July, but uh, why don't you include it in your summary and in your complaint, and uh, I'll look for, uh, look, at, look into that as well. Does that sound good? Um, I mean, can I expect you guys to, uh, are you going to, can you give me your word that you're going to actually act on this and try to... Uh... I will certainly review and look into any complaints or allegations you have. Absolutely. I can't tell you that you'll get whatever results you want or don't want. I will have to investigate it, but we will certainly follow up. And I will certainly follow up. Okay? All right. I hope okay. you can understand can my frustration. My address, I'm sorry, sir? I said I hope you can understand my frustration at this process. Yeah, I understand your frustration. I'll try to help you out. Do the right thing. Let's try to work together, and we'll hopefully get an answer for you. Let's going to start with a, with a delineated complaint as to, as to what you're what your grievance is, okay? Okay. Have a good day. All right, sir. All right, sir. Thank you very much.